Welcome to The Reading Forest. Today, we're reading Bush Turkey by Kate and Joel Temple, illustrated by Rono Joy Gahosh. In the dark undergrowth near a tree fern crop, where the leeches wriggle and the frogs go pop, is an unusual fellow. He's really quite quirky. He has many names, but let's call him Bush Turkey. His bald head is red like a traffic light. His tail plumes are as black as midnight. He wears a yellow necktie and is impeccably dressed. And right now he's building the world's best ever nest. I'll need more than sticks to make my home flash, says Bush Turkey, taking off in a wobbly dash. His beady eye is on a neighbouring block, utes parked out front, tradies on the clock. They're building a house right up from the ground, timber, tiles, tools, just lying around. Turkey struts onto the site, he needs no introduction. All this hardware has sparkled his appetite for construction. What I could bang up with a cordless power tool, a dream mansion with its own horizon pool. I'll use that timber to build an entertaining deck. Then he makes off with a nail gun wrapped around his neck. They won't miss a bag of cement or that tube of old glue says Bush Turkey, which of course isn't true. Come on, toughen up. Watching this heist is a working dog named Molly. Sharp as a tack, tough as nails, a dingo cross collie. Hey, that's not your stuff, you cheeky old bird, barks Molly, running so fast her feet are all blurred. Bush Turkey is startled and begins to flap wildly. It all turns to chaos, and that's putting it mildly. Drop it like it's hot. Turkey bangs into a ladder. Clatter, crash, floppity do. Paint tins go flying. What a hullabaloo. The concrete mixer is knocked to high speed. The barrow goes rolling. Builders caught in the stampede. What happens next? just isn't fair. Poor Molly gets the blame and shoots Turkey a glare. Bush Turkey struts off while Molly's put on a leash and the tradies break for a pea and ham quiche. Turkey takes full advantage of Molly's situation and helps himself to a roll of insulation. Then he makes off with whatever else he can carry, even the hard hat of a builder Named Barry. Turkey drags his loot back into the bush, pulling, heaving, huffing with a feathery push. It's time to start work on an engineering feat, nailing timber, threading wires. This is not easy. Pouring concrete, building with cement gets harder and harder. Beams and rafters are slapped together with plaster. Bush Turkey stands back to admire this wonky disaster. A masterpiece, says Turkey, as he lays the last bricks. It's the perfect home for me and my soon-to-be chicks. A home can come in all different shapes and sizes. But the best houses are full of surprises. You're totally adorable.